I was going to do something Thursday, and the person I was doing it with asked if we could do it tonight. So I was not actually napping. I was being a busy human being. Doing human being things. Will I successfully line incense burner up with one of the big hits from an elite fight? Let's find out. Jimmy Jangles, thanks for the 17 months. I do have some outside obligations. Kind of weird, huh? Wow, 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 wow. Wow's a wow, wowers. Could be a poet. Or maybe that is a poem. Maybe you're quoting a poem. What do I know? It is a hexaghost act for fire breathing. But I think I take chemo because of wanting to be able to take this path, maybe. Imagine if I do this path. That is very unlikely. Very unlikely. But it would be cool. Strike, strike, chemo. This doesn't actually cost me more health, because I don't play chemo, so I save 2 HP. Cost me one more health. You just thought, wow, 17 is a big number. But then you expressed yourself in a very poetic and beautiful way. I think if I'm picking between Feel No Pain and Evolve, I'd rather have Evolve and a Hexagos Dex, probably. But gosh, Feel No Pain is just a better card, right? I think so. Rolandite. Thanks for two months. Appreciate it. That sucks. Maybe I don't get this next elite fight. My incense burner is on a pretty bad number. And I have to end this fight now. Double hemo? Okay. It seems kind of broken. By which I mean all of my health is going to be gone soon. Why am I meant to start this? Three, four, five. Next turn, one, then it's two, three, then not at four. Let's start next turn or the turn after. Yeah, Blomsky, he's near lull. Hello, everyone. Wanna have Bash plus Hemo? Yeah, I mean, that's actually true. I suppose. Wait, what? Emo costs one? What a broken card. Um. <laughs> hey, Otter. All right, we are back to having this on the wrong number. Loads line plus. Don't hate it. Wild strike plus. Shouldn't need wild strike plus. Double hemo. I don't think. Hour three is also just a very good card. But Hexagos is a long fight, and it looks like I'm reliant on drawing my hemos repeatedly for me to win it. We're doing six things to 22 months. 
So like, I guess ideally I want incense burner to be on a different number from this, right? I was hoping not to get attacked there. Is it worth seven health to put it on three? Probably not with this many chemos, because I kill Gremlin Knob before the big attack sometimes. I don't think I can say no to Anger Pulse right now, but at this point I have to like stop taking bad attacks probably. Zephyr, leave her alone. I'm not sure that Zephyr actually understands English. But hopefully I've made my point clear. So I want to fight a super elite right now. I want this on three. I probably can put it on three. I'm paying two health. I'm not actually paying two health because it costs me two health to play a hemo anyway. Yep. Okay. Bronze scales kills hexaghost. Pommel plus? Okay, I have a lot of attacks. And they're all upgraded. I don't know how to play this turn. Did I choose double hemo? I did. I did choose double hemo. I should have played the defend. Why don't I play the defend? This game is so free. Wait, what? I gotta remove a strike. I don't want these, I don't think. I have exactly enough gold for power through plus evolve. It's very hard not to buy power through plus and evolve. Maybe I'll get like uh, pandas or something. I have a lot of strikes, is the only thing. But I'm going to take a lot of cards because I have two eggs. So I think it's okay to take power through evolve. Having this many eggs makes it significantly less painful to be having five strikes. That makes sense to me. In my head, it makes sense. I don't want to start next turn because three, four, five, I'd miss. So I want to start two turns from now, which means there's no reason to play Bash. I guess I can play it in case I see, like, Double hemo this hand or something and convince myself I should start. Actually, if I hadn't played it, I could have played Anger and had another Anger. So maybe that was just very wrong. Um. Okay. 
I feel like you don't take power through enough. Yeah, you should probably take power through, like, a lot. I think power through is... Basically, it's worth doing a lot for power through to be strong in your deck. Nuclear Wasted, thanks for the two years. Also, on top of that, power through can pretty easily become very strong in a deck. What are the chances I don't deal 18 next turn? Like, zero? I do have unupgraded stuff. Ah, fine. Ceramic fish makes the click on every card that I'm offered strategy a lot more appealing to you. I'm gonna take an Iron Wave plus maybe. Or am I not? I said I wanted to click on every card I was offered. Also take a demon form. That seems terrible. Does not seem like what I should do. You know. A room we pedal in Persa. I just killed all four elites, huh? One, two, three, four. I sure did. I'm gonna take it. I haven't removed a basic yet. You're welcome, Ebbia. Ebbia Sappho? Ebbia Saff. I don't know. I guess one way to make power through okay is just to have so many cards that you'll never draw the wounds. Maybe use this now. Maybe I should have used it earlier. I have buy a stuff. Okay, I might remember that, but I make absolutely no promises. I got bash upgrade because I'm gonna have to actually deal damage to this somehow, right? I can't play Evolve. Whoops. I've decided it's more important to play Evolve than Bash. Maybe that's true. I have been offered a lot of upgraded cards. It's true. I'm not sure it has much to do with RNG. Other Solution thanks for the 14 months. Evolve to draw more burns. You joke, and yet you're right. You joke, and yet. Where is my bath? I have not applied vulnerable to this enemy yet in this fight. Whenever you see a recent tweet by me, I'm live. Did I tweet recently? I didn't tweet recently, did I? I think I might just always be live. I think that might be what you're observing. Hey, Matsu! Both of these cards are very good. I tweeted 16 minutes ago? No. No way. Oh, I replied to Voxy's Minecraft thing. Hey, you're right. 
I think like conceptually I don't think of replies to other people's tweets as tweeting, but I suppose objectively that is tweeting. It would be cool to find bites. It would be a very good bite of that. I don't know if that's actually a big enough deal to go to a bunch of question marks, though. Because with feed, hallway fights are better. For max HP and all that. Also, I am... The act is trying to kill me, so that is a thing to be aware of. I don't know if I want two shops. I think we just go this way. The seed is also very aggressive about me taking early shop, yeah. Incense Burner is interesting in these decks, which can't really control when the fight ends very well. I would rather it ended next turn than this turn, so no reason to pommel for the feat. It was a good first fight of the act, I'll say. I think I take another power through plus. That card seems really good. And I already have an evolve. Twelve, thirty-two, forty-nine. I'm down to turn a flex button to four HP. Weeks, thanks for the 53 months. There's the rupture. I don't think it's actually a very good rupture at this point, though. I can never upgrade it, right? And I still only have the two hemos. Do not have a disarm. Did not get attacked this turn. I am upset about that. Ow. Might still get a feed off though. I'm intangible next turn. Mm, but it dies. So I can never wait until two turns from now I have to draw the feed now. Yeah. In the Rouge. Prismatic chart? I'm just really struggling to draw enough cards right now. I have the double pommel, but that's kind of it. Eventually I have an evolve. But it doesn't even draw more cards, it's an unupgraded evolve. It just draws the statuses. I don't think I'm taking another feel no pain. I don't think I'm taking a Seeing Rod. The Whirlwind is interesting. FPM thinks the 49 months. 
Maybe it's just a Vajra. Vajra's like fine, right? Stop for links the ten months. I have indeed killed several hearts in my life at this point. Probably I'm going to a campfire and have to rest out, so I think I try to save the potion. Yeah. You made a playlist as long as you know all the words, too, so you can sing along to them while you go through repetitive tasks at work. That is such a good idea. How many songs do you know the words to? worth of songs. I wonder how many songs I know all the words to. Never really thought about it before. a fine card. Deals 20 damage for one and doesn't afraid of anyone. I don't even want to go to the campfire. Especially with an anchor. Just keep going this way. What the fuck is this song? <laughs> I love the doors. You know the words to every Mozart song? I suppose I do as well. I'm just kind of like cheating though. It all three, right? That's where it ended up. I think that ended up dealing, dealing three. There are a bunch of Mozart operas, probably. I believe Mozart was somewhat prolific in the creation of music. Burnt muffins, thanks for 18 months. Hope you're doing well. He died. Did not write the libretti though. Is that one of the plot points from Amadeus? Without knowing anything about what you're saying, I'm going to guess it is. Not very shockwavy very quickly. Shockwave plus, not a terrible card. It does make the clothesline plus and bash plus in my deck a little bit less exciting though. I'm actually gonna take this over, feel my pan, I think. Just need card draw. Also, I don't have much exhaust, really. The second feel no pain doesn't even do much. Hmm. Am I still looking for bites? I don't know that I am anymore. I got two strike removes. If 
I'm not, maybe I should go this way instead of this way then. Get fewer question marks. TRS thinks for the three months. You had a music teacher who would take points off your grade, like your overall grade, if you called a song without words a song, because you thought if no one was singing, it can't be called a song. Oh. Maybe it can't be. Maybe he was right. What is it called then? A musical piece, maybe? I don't know. Concerto, an opera. Wait, operas have words. A nocturne. Hard to get excited about the Sarments, isn't it? Also kind of hard to be excited about the bloodletting. You just can't draw cards. This is such a common ironclad thing. You just like draw five cards a turn and that's your life. And it kind of sucks. With no words, it's just an ong. Okay, Twitch shop. Why draw many cards when a few cards do big thing? Don't know. Maybe there's no real reason. So I think it's the 10 months. Okay, I'm going to continue taking pommel strikes, I guess, and then I'm going to die to the champion. Sorry, El Campion. Chemo right now. Second wind. Second wind, and I try to do power through second wind things with evolve. Like the best I've got, I think. Another power thing. Ceramic fish doing MVP things again. I'm glad that you said it. Like I was going to say it, but I felt like maybe it was too early to make the call. But yeah, I think ceramic fish MVP. I think you're right. I 
That is true, radioactive salmon. Why are you radioactive? This made you radioactive. Shuriken. Reaper. Suddenly, things are happening. Just out of nowhere. Boom. Shuriken Reaper. I think stat stuffing or orbs is more powerful on Ironclad. Probably stat swapping. I'm gonna go stat swapping. Should I take a fourth pommel strike? Probably. I feel so gross about it though. I do not take the fourth pommel strike happily. It's like once five energy. Please don't curse saying I have you playing on my TV and my mom won't get mad if you say bad words. Okay. I'm sorry, level one Bidoof. Making Pommel Strike isn't a personality. It might be a personality. A little bit of a personality. Why is Silent such a good character design? Um, oh. You had golf ball sized hail, are you? Shit. Is your stuff okay? Is that like able to damage cars and things? Spent 81 bucks to fill up your car. I don't have a car. And we've just discussed why, basically. Is golf ball a standard unit of measurement in the states? If you ever go to the states and we measure things in golf balls for you, just know that we're being kind because the other units of measurement are significantly harder to understand. The deck is sweet. Chunking. This ironclad really just doesn't afraid of anyone. More than most ironclads that I've seen. Huh. I don't think I'm taking choker though. 
I take a runic down, right? Blue whales thanks to the 22 months. Yeah, there's no way I can take Choker, because I have a double tap plus that I just took. Would completely ruin that turn. Alright. Dome it is. People call me Yorbs sometimes. Especially European people. I am Yorbs. I've never been called Horbs by a Spanish-speaking person. At least not, like, that I remember. Which is interesting. Maybe I just don't have any Spanish-speaking friends. Or maybe the ones I have know what my name is pronounced like. <laughs> No friends. I'm doing okay for myself. Too many friends, if anything. Wait, why can't I see what they're doing? This is awful. Are you not my friends? No, no, you're you're not my friends. Correct. What clued you in? What gave it away? How do you I know every time someone who speaks Spanish types my name they aren't pronouncing in Your question just broke my head. I hope you think long and hard about what you've done. <laughs> I mean, like, I mean, what am I meant to do? Not take it? I have no card draw. I have no card draw and five energy. <laughs> I did say I wanted card draw, it's true. doing unlucky I enjoy long slay the spire runs in my office and playing pommel strike I take a headbutt so I can put pommel strike on top you think I'm joking and yet I have to go to a campfire, which I don't really want to do. I'm at full health and all that. I bet let's put Reaper on top sometimes. And Double Tap is more of a card to put on top than Almost Strike, really. Hey, May, how are you? I don't know what I'm doing. It's also an argument to take a Sword Boomerang as just a strength scaling attack, which I do not currently have. 
actually gonna take a sword boomerang. Fuck it, I have cultist potion. We're doing it live. Strike dummy would be okay here, yeah? Would not be a terrible strike dummy. Oops. Might be hard to feed now. Oh, that's another thing that Hotbot does. I don't think I've missed a feed. I've been so lucky with feeds. How do I feel about a perfected strike here? Eight, and it would be upgraded, obviously. That would not be a bad perfected strike, honestly. I'm going to draw four pommel strikes with it, and I won't be able to draw off them. I'm excited about this. This eventuality. Winters in Chicago really feel like they'll never fully end, and then one day it's just 80 degrees and humid. It's May. You should not remember that winter existed. It's May. <laughs> you can actually change the weather, it's just forbidden by a law. I feel like that kind of assumes a large amount of functionality in, like, policy execution, which is maybe not deserved by the people who would be in charge of changing the weather. The Bud Light weather change. I'll just kill it now, I don't want a parasite, right? Hello? How it's upgraded? Hello. Okay. Starting to get somewhere. Can we draw cards yet? We're getting there. Do you mean may we draw cards yet? If it's doing the big attack, it deserves to deal damage to me. Yeah, I didn't think so. I knew from the second I walked into this fight, this is a coward maw. There's this, like, very consistent argument made by people who 
like Fahrenheit as a system of measurement that it makes more sense than Celsius because the numbers relate to useful parts of the human experience or something like that. Y'all know about this argument? Like, a hundred is meant to be really hot, and zero is meant to be really cold for humans. Which I personally find very bizarre. Is like, 82 is really hot, and like, 60 is really cold. So I just don't understand it all. Absolutely everything should be in Kelvin. I'm in Kelvin, you're in Kelvin. The man on the bus is in Kelvin. Okay, I actually played Battle Trance and drew three pommel strikes, by the way. Like, that actually just happened. Well done, me. Well done. I think that's worthy of applause. Just solid deck building? Yeah, thank you. Thanks. You twirl, your hair, you twirl your hair a lot. Do I think wearing a propeller hat would help you curb this habit for fear of flying away? I wore a propeller hat once. It had very little effect on me, honestly. I think the girl I was playing beer pong with found it really entertaining. It was sort of weird, because she was, like, very openly flirting with me, and then my friend took me aside and told me that she had a boyfriend. I'd forgotten this memory. Hmm. What a strange world. Anyway, probably it was because of the propeller hat. Nothing wrong with being a backup plan, hey? There have been a lot of great backup plans in the world. Shrug. Take those. You have a girlfriend and couldn't resist flirting with me? Fair. Suddenly I have a juggernaut. This was not entirely intentional. Well, there's a pommel strike in the shop, so... Could bottle a shockwave. Probably this is really good. Oh, especially with battle trance, it's pretty good. Have you ever speedrun a game other than Celeste? XCOM 2. Uh, what's the expansion called? I don't remember. Whatever the expansion's called. War of the Chosen? There you go. XCOM 2 War of the Chosen, I speed ran. <laughs> Juggernaut second wind to feel no pain is a lot of damage, it's true. I do already deal a lot of damage with all of the other things in the deck, but I can also deal a lot of damage with that. I might actually buy another palm strike. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I have five. But I could have six. If you get eight of them, do you get collector bonus twice? I 
Unexpected pineapple. Every pummel strike I take makes the YouTube thumbnail better. We don't care about the YouTube thumbnails here though, do we? We're not all about that. It feels like selling out or something. I would describe myself as the least sold out person in the entire world. Sell out Jorbs, just not words that go together. Want to see something cool? Boom! Now that I have drawn, well, bought orange pallets, I can play Battle Trance and draw four pummel strikes and then still draw with them. A major improvement to my deck. Did I decide what flavor of body fluid to make my G fuel with? Did you, did you get told about that? That was a private message that I sent to Alex. That was between me and him. Ball. I won't forget this. I think Subversal? I don't know. Maybe. Oh my god, they're all just shops. Every single one of them. It's a shop. That's a shop. This is a shop. This is a shop. I could remove two more strikes. Probably pretty good. I only have one strike. I guess I couldn't then. I just buy self-forming clay. The relic is broken. I love the perseverance exhibited by Twitch chat. It's like that Disney movie where they pushed lemmings off the cliff, except actually happening. Without the executives at Disney pushing the lemmings off the cliff. hard to push Twitch chat off a cliff. I could probably do it. How's this reckless charge? I have evolved Dark Embrace, Feel No Pain, Juggernaut. So it's not bad. Take it. Is Disney pushing lemmings off a cliff a metaphor for the reason? No, they actually they actually did that. They made a documentary about lemmings in which they pushed a bunch of lemmings off a cliff.
I know this because I read it on the internet, so it must be true. Just want you all to know that I take my uh, journalistic integrity very seriously. I've done so much due diligence before regurgitating this fact. How am I into mini jobs? I'm doing okay. I hope that mini jobs is all right. He had some legal stuff going on. He's probably good. I guess it's just barely worth taking Reaper there. I don't know. Reaper is not a very impressive card right now, honestly. Gonna cite this clip on Wikipedia. Sounds awesome. Have fun. Am I doing better after getting offered a Reaper? Let's be honest, I'm always doing great. Nope's fat check. White old nurse lemming suicide. True. 1958 award Academy Award winning true life adventure nature documentary. Is this why they have to write no animals were harmed in the filming of this documentary? This is fucked up. Lemmings do not periodically hurl themselves off cliffs and into the sea. It's a strong sentence. I also do not periodically hurl myself off a cliff and into the sea. Maybe have played the defend there. Maybe I will after Disney buys Twitch. Disney is going to buy Twitch. The world keeps getting more and more exciting. Disney was going to buy Twitch. How should I adjust my behavior to prepare for this eventuality? Are they also going to buy, like, a grocery store near me and stuff? Wow, yeah, the fact that this company might be bought by a different company is going to make me deciding to get a bunch of Amazon tattoos really awkward. Also, the house that I painted in Amazon brand colors is going to be weird when I have people over. It's not actually going to buy Twitch? You think that was a joke? Well, I don't actually have any tattoos. I'm not cool enough.
There's no reward for blind brand loyalty anymore. The state of the world. <laughs> Absolutely. It's disgusting, isn't it? When I was a kid... Gosh, when I was a kid, let me tell you. What's the coolness threshold for having a tattoo? It's more that if you get a tattoo, you become cool, and I don't want to become cool. I don't want to be intimidating to you all, it would be bad for my career. And I feel like you would be intimidated by me. There was a burrito chain in San Francisco that offered free burritos for life. If you got a tattoo of their logo, they're still honoring the 15 or so people who did it. I feel like that's probably a net positive transaction for them. Like, that's a lot of advertising, right? I imagine this is just like a good deal for everyone involved. I don't see anything wrong with it. You don't consider yourself cool unless someone implies that you're not cool. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that is actually true about you. I'm glad you know that. Never intended to get tattoos in your life. But you've ended up with one. Are you cool for not trying to be cool? Well, you're just cool because you have a tattoo. It's an involuntary sort of thing. You have a bunch of tattoos because you get to put art on your body like stickers. That is what tattoos are. I don't know if I'm going to get this feed off. Also, I guess I want to be on 4. Or act 4 anyway. You know what? You're all pretty cool. That I was reading. Beast said that. I was reading someone in chat who wrote those words. What if you made a tattoo that said tattoos are not cool? You wouldn't. There's no way you'd do that. It's broken, doesn't work. Just go back for more, still doesn't work. Weird. Nice HP, 140. The, uh... Sex number for... Um... Rotund Equestrians, maybe? Is rotunda mean word? It's very like a funny word. I mean, it's a mean word. It does mean round, but it means round in sort of a like mean way. I think. I don't know.
I think if someone was going to insult me, I would want them to call me a gazebo. And I'm not sure why, but I just feel like... I feel like I would be so upset, but also, like, kind of like... Like, what am I going to say, you know? A dread gazebo or an or just an ordinary gazebo? That would be one of the reasons it was so upsetting for them to say that. Just telling me it was ordinary. Ordinary and a gazebo. Don't remember what's happening this turn. Oh, apparently the Spire Shield is dying. Works for me. This? I don't know, maybe. Gazebo D's. Gazebo D's? That was uh, like an ancient Greek, right? Gazebo D's. The heart is not weak. Hey, I found Shockwave. Is it okay if I don't explain why, but just tell you that your question made me think of Buffalo Bill in Silence of the Lambs? I feel like that's the appropriate response to your question. So I'm being attacked for like 40 or something, not a big deal. Not a big deal. Red Skull's almost online, but not quite. I feel like without the Sword Boomerang I would have lost that one for sure. 